the horrific crash. A 15-year-old Indian-American child prodigy has reached a milestone in his academic journey. Tanishk Abraham is all set to start his doctorate after completing his graduation in biomedical engineering. Tanishk, uh, who graduated from the University of California, Davis, with the highest honors of uh, summa cum laude, has uh, now decided to head for a PhD. He'll be studying at the same university and eventually wants to pursue medical school. He's always harbored big dreams of finding solutions to problems and has designed a device that could measure the heart rate of burn patients without touching them. The 15-year-old has showed promise ever since he was a toddler. His parents noticed that he loved children's books and by the age of two, he could remember and recall everything he heard and read, including how to tell the time on the clock. Earlier, my colleague Akanksha Swaroop spoke with Tanishk Abraham. Listen into their conversation. Tanishk, firstly, a very warm welcome to you on We On. You have achieved remarkable heights at a very tender age. So let me begin by asking you, how and when did your parents discover that you were ahead of your age? Um, I think my parents discovered it. Uh, from what I hear, they discovered it around when I was like two or three years old, when they realized I was doing more advanced uh the advanced stuff, like in terms of, um, you know, math and things like that. I was doing close to like first grade level uh, material already. Right. Tanish, don't you think your talents would be better suited in the fields of medicine or biotechnology? As a child prodigy, why do you wish to run for public office? Well, um, of course, I think that if, if uh, one is passionate for something that, of course, they should... Uh, uh, try their best to achieve that and um and similarly i am interested in in uh in in government and in um in politics and so that's why um I, um that's why i'm interested in running for uh for president uh, when i grow older and i think that um yeah uh, ever since i was around nine years old eight years old that's where i've been interested and been following um following you know news and all right tanish since you harbor the ambition of becoming the u.s president someday when do you intend to start campaigning for elections um you can only become president when you're 35 so sometime around then um i would have to i would i would start campaigning obviously um for the next uh, uh election cycle obviously um um but making a difference and again, I think it will depend because um, that is still um, some time into the future. Also, Tadish, how do you see the current America governed by Donald Trump? Do you believe he will make America great again? Well, of course, one thing I'd like to say is that um, there's no need to make America great again because it's already great. So I think, uh, of course, uh, important to make America greater. Um, and while I might not agree with some of his uh, policies, of course, I uh, will, I'll, I'll be rooting for America's president, whoever it may be. So, yeah. Right. Tanishq, you have Indian roots. What's your message for all Indian students? One of the messages I always like to tell uh, Indian students and, and students around the world um, is to, of course, follow their passion and, um, and yeah, uh, do what you love. I've been, uh, I'm interested in science and engineering and and that's what I've been uh, uh, following. And and of course, if you uh, if it, when it, when you're doing something that you love, it's obviously fun for you to do, and it makes it a lot easier, of course, in the studying and things like that. And you really enjoy it. And so that's what uh, I think it's important to uh, follow your passion and to do uh, to do what you uh, what you love to do. So, yeah. All right, Tanish, thank you so much for speaking to us here on Vion. We wish you all the success in life. Thank you for your wishes, and thank you for having me.